you've got one of those prominent voices as being the Grim Reaper. Do you remember, was that was that a call when you got brought on for, for the Grim Adventure of Billy Man to try out and everything? Obviously that was just a, probably a call from your agent or your manager, correct? Yeah, yeah. They were, um, Jesus, when I look, as I look back, I don't really, well, yeah, they were looking for a, a voice and uh, we were just messing around in the studio. I might have already recorded something and I think maybe the casting director or the voice, the voice director may have been Chris Zimmerman. They were Chris Zimmerman. So we're doing the cartoon. Can you come over something? The voice would be in mm -hmm. um, My The voice is predicated on a guy, an actor by the name of Jeffrey Holder, who was prominent in the 70s. Jeffrey Holder was not only an actor, he was a great uh, director, choreographer, costume designer, uh, dancer, painter. He was just this, this Renaissance dude, but he had this. Deep fossil fundo, yeah. or maybe at voice, he was some printed that he was printed mm -hmm. And um, I know you uh, heard the movie The Lives with Santa Claus and Michael Jackson. Yeah, yeah well, he directed and 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 basically was the, the force behind the stage version because before it became a movie with Diana Ross and Michael Jackson was on was on Broadway as a musical, and he was a creative force behind that. You know, he choreographed it, he designed the costume, he directed it. He won a Tony Award for all of his efforts. So that's where that voice came from. Because when I, when they, they wanted some, I knew they wanted a deep voice. But if I just gave them a deep voice, that, you know, that could have been, been boring. So yeah. I decided to put this career and spin on it. And I think um, when Max heard it, he just, he just freaked out. He really liked it. Because I think initially he was thinking about a British voice, like uh, yeah. this guy named, um, he might have told you, like Christopher Plummer or the guy that played mm -hmm. Dracula, I think, in the old movies back in the, 60s whatever so i put a i put a caribbean spin on it and i think yeah it kind of worked it well it did work i think it looked pretty good <laughs>